so let's get down to it the pleasure pain balance of okay. dopamine All i right. think the uh, uh which is you know foundational to this entire conversation mm -hmm. right so we have to hit it um can you start us off by just trying to explain the pleasure pain balance sure so the pleasure pain balance is a metaphor for what happens in our brain as we become addicted. It's obviously an oversimplification uh, of the phenomenon. The brain is a very complex structure and those limbic forebrain uh, nuclei in combination with the prefrontal cortex, it's all very complicated and we're just now discovering it. But it does get to the heart of one of the fundamental changes that happens in the brain as we go from recreational adaptive um, non-harmful use to uh, addictive, um, impactful, harmful use. Mm -hmm. So essentially, um, that pleasure-pain balance represents how we process pleasure and pain. Um, again, an oversimplification, but um, very in very broad brush strokes, um, when we do something that's pleasurable, that balance tips one way. When we do something that's painful, it tips the other. And there are certain rules governing that balance. One of the first and most important rules is that the balance wants to remain level, or what neuroscientists call homeostasis. And with any deviation from neutrality, our brains will work very hard to restore a level balance. So the question is, how do they do that? And what, uh, what the opponent process theory shows is that the way that we restore a level balance is first by tilting an equal and opposite amount to whatever the initial stimulus was. So if you imagine that, um, we ingest an intoxicant that releases dopamine in our brain's reward pathway. The balance tilts to the side of pain. No sooner has that happened than our brain adapts to the increased dopamine by downregulating dopamine transmission, not just to baseline levels, but below baseline. You might imagine that as these neuroadaptation gremlins hopping on the pain side of the balance to bring it level again, but they like it there, so they stay on until it's tilted an equal and opposite amount to the side of pain. That's the hangover, the come down, the blue Monday, mm. or even just that moment of wanting one more piece of chocolate, one more potato chip, yeah. to want to watch one more TikTok video. Mm. 